YouTube, what's going on? My name is Argon. Welcome back to some Fortnite informational, instructional, conversational type of content. Today, guys, we're going to be talking about the big rocket that's gone missing in Fortnite Battle Royale. As many of you guys know, on the west side of the map, right next to Snobby Shores, there's a mountain, and in that mountain, there's an evil lair where the evil guy lives in the in the uh, Fortnite world, I guess you want to call it. In his lair, he's got a rocket that's just been sitting in a silo. Nobody knows what it's been there for, but in this week's uh, update, guys, for update 4.5, they're going to actually remove that rocket in the map that's actually been leaked we now see some images leaked of the post uh, patch map which is going to probably release tonight or tomorrow we'll see sometime this week and in that map there is no rocket located where the rocket used to be and a lot of people think that supports the claim that you may be able to launch the rocket because there was some files leaked uh, last week or two weeks ago that basically showed a bunch of names that sounded like rocket launch and countdown and all this kind of thing so people are theorizing that you could be able to actually launch it I actually have the alternate theory which is probably more realistic if you guys remember near the end of season 3 the comment or meteor or whatever you want to call it appeared in the sky and had everybody wondering what the heck was going on and at some point they even added an audio animation or audio file to it to give it some sound when you like looked at it or aimed at it so my theory is now that they're actually going to launch the rocket and what you're going to see is the rocket's actually going to be in the sky for about a week or two probably it's going to be headed eastbound because if you didn't know also there's a good guy lair or a good guy mansion on the east side of the map uh, just south of Lonely Lodge, it's a pretty cool place, you should check it out, it's almost never attended to, so if you go there, you're probably going to get loot and see a cool house, <laughs> it's the biggest house in the map I, as far as I know of, so either way, I, my theory is that Rocket's going to be headed towards the east side of the map, towards the, the um, you know, the good guy's mansion, kind of promotes the, uh, the ongoing story that's going on in season four of heroes and villains, and it's a movie and all this kind of thing. Uh, it wouldn't make any sense at all for you to be able to launch the, the rocket in-game. That would make zero sense. It would totally throw off the game. It wouldn't make it make any sense at all, to be honest. And on top of that, I think it's going to look exactly like the way the comet looked, where it's going to be floating kind of in the sky, because if you guys don't know how rockets work, basically, they have to launch up, then they go into the atmosphere, and it takes about, you know... 10 to 20 minutes uh, to fly a rocket around the world to actually hit a target. So that kind of would jive with the length of time that it takes to play a match of Fortnite Battle Royale. It's going to be flying in the sky, guys. I would bet money on it that you can't launch it in game. That would just make the game broken. It would make any sense at all. You're going to see it in the sky as part of the ongoing story. They also released, you know, the guy's two epic buddies that leak everything. They also replied to Ali A, who was asking about if the countdown, because if you didn't know, in Nintendo Switch, there was a countdown that appeared on all the TVs throughout the map. For the rest of us, we got like a skull and crossbones type of image. But on Nintendo Switch, there was a countdown timer. So Ali A was asking if that countdown timer is still live on Switch. And uh, what the Die Buddies or two epic buddies said was, I'm not sure. The only thing I found were some rocket animation files which suggest that you may be able to launch that thing maybe they delayed it I actually don't think that the animation is going to make you able to launch it. it just means it's going to be up in the sky you might see some smoke trails or fire coming out of the back of it or something or it might actually be moving across the sky throughout the course of the map or throughout the course of a game that's it there's absolutely oh man I would be so shocked if they figured out a way to get you to be able to launch it but there's probably no way it, it falls in line with what we've seen at the end of season three where you actually had a meteor show up this is right around the time you started seeing the meteor show up in season three so it would kind of make sense for the rocket to take off and start flying now to kind of culminate the you know this movie for season four and that the good guy is now gonna have to figure out how to stop the rocket from landing and destroying the world or maybe it will and then we'll get a whole new map for season five we'll know as we're going along guys but that's the truth as far as we know it now, we don't have any evidence that you can launch it. All the past history and everything that makes sense about the game shows that you'll probably see it in the sky starting tomorrow and that you'll be able to, you know, enjoy its looks, I guess. You probably won't be able to launch it. That just literally would make no sense. Either way, guys, that's it. That's all we got for this video. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below. If you did enjoy this video, hit that like button. If you are new here, make sure you subscribe. And if you're not following me on social media, those links are down in the description below. And as always, guys, my name is Argon, and may you never die to a bush. Peace.